hello friends welcome to my youtube channel and today i'm going to show you how you can easily install zamp in windows computer so friend this is my windows 11 computer and here i'm going to install zamp so here you will learn step by step all the things so keep watching this is very important tutorial today i'm going to share with you guys so friend let's jump into computer and install zamp so friend first of all we are going to open our browser and search zamp so here you can see this is zamp and we are going to download this jamp over here you simply click on that download option and here you will see these are the different different versions are available okay so we are going to install a very advanced version over here so we are going to click on this 64-bit computer so we are going to download it it will take little bit time to download and then after i will show you step by step to install it okay so let's see how it is working so here we are going to click on this click here so this zamp option is showing over here we are going to download it simply click on this download latest version so this software will download shortly so friend now you can see that my download is going done it will take approximately eight to nine seconds and we are going to install this application in my windows 11 simply click on this icon so what happened so now this is showing just simply please press yes so this will installing so we are going to close this browser and now we are going to click on this continue with installation you simply click on that yes so this will install the apache you simply click on this ok and then click on this next button and here you will see these are the options so right now all things is done so don't change it you simply click on this next button and this c drive and it will create a directory zamp you simply click on this next button don't change it and this is the language part you simply select as it is and so now click on this next button so your zamp will install and here you will get mysql application php and peril so these will install into your system and this is the apache things and all things will install into your system and after that i will guide you how to create a php file and test it uh, our installation is is done or not so keep watching so now this will take a little bit time so after that we will check it out how it will install and how it will work so friend you can see that my installation is going done and it is asking me some permission so we are going to allow it and here you can see all things are going done so friend here you can see do you want to start the control panel now you simply click on this finish button so your apache will run and here you will get one pop-up box so first thing first you are going to click on this start button so your apache will start and you will get this green mark and again click on this mysql and it will ask for the permission allow it and this will also a perfect way it will work we are going to check it out how it will work okay so simply click on this net start check all the things everything is working good and now we are going to start a browser and here we are going to simply search localhost so whenever i type localhost then you will see that this apache page is showing and here when you click on this php info then this will give you the idea how many which version is available what things are updated and all things you can see over here so now we are going to create a sample php file and run it on localhost okay so what you will do simply click on this explorer folder and then click on this c drive here we are going to click on this zamp and after that find out ht docs and here we are going to create a new folder here we are going to type my name like vijay and let's make a notepad file which is index.php okay upcoming video i will show you how you can create php file and all but this is my notepad file and here i'm going to open it so simply drag this file and we are going to add some code 
php echo okay this is a sample code which is i'm going to put in this is hello world okay so now we are going to save it and let's run this page so here we are going to simply type the folder which i have created and here we are going to press enter so friend you will see that this is showing hello world so now this is the message which is showing your php is working your installation is done now okay so friend this is the tutorial which i want to share with you guys how you can easily install xamp and how you can create directory into that and add a php code and run it okay so everything is going smooth and i hope you like this video if you like this video then click on like button and share with your friends and family so they can also learn about these things how to install xamp in your windows computer and if maybe you have any query or question friends you can comment me below so i'll be We'll give you the answer so friend thank you for watching and stay tuned with me and we will meet in next video and i request you guys if you are coming first time on this channel don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel because we uploading this type of tutorials every day so friend thank you for watching and stay tuned with me we will meet in next video stay tuned